YouTube Chicks <laughs> Get ready You know what to do Chicks so listen, Chicks Smooth Hey Chicks Smooth Appreciate all the coverage that you been doing I've been watching your shit for a while I just subscribed to your shit too bro Hey man we gotta make a decision soon Are we pushing peace or are we pushing the streets? Now this morning, a lot of Gilly fans woke up disappointed. Gilly posted a video of him not only in the streets of ATL, but he was in one of the most dangerous hoods in ATL. He just wrapped up an interview with Honcho, but Gilly decided that was not enough. He wanted to show you guys all the street gang members he was around. Here's a video. You know where we at? Second half. Huh? 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 Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Huh? We where them niggas scared to come, huh? <laughs> Second ass, nigga. Huh? Huh? Yeah. Come on, nigga. Where we at, nigga? Yeah. Where we at? Yeah. Where we at? Yeah. I know what's going on, man. Come on, I know they ain't playing modest now. Come to second half. Huh? Huh? I know these playing modest now. Pulled up the second end. Huh? Huh? Where the big dog at, man? Where the big dog at, man? Fucking big dog at, man. Where the big dog at, man? Where the fucking big dog at, man? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You see it. Big dog shit, man. Shout out to Atlanta, man. Short so much love. Now fans immediately went on Gilly's comments and called him out. Somebody said, Gilly, you're too old to promote this kind of stuff. You should help him get closer to God. There's kids watching your page. Show them the right path and not none of this, brother. You're the example of the younger generation. Them brothers need to stay far away from that stuff and go live a beautiful lifestyle. Just because you're raised in the hood doesn't give you the excuse to stay there. It's a choice. There ain't nothing good. Brother, stay out of it. Another fan said, yo, that shit was pointless. You're too old and got too much bread to be doing meaningless shit in the hood. You're doing exactly what Wallow be preaching about. Now, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Gilly definitely looks crazy posting this video. Nobody is saying do not go to the hood and interview street rappers but when you're posting this video basically giving a shout out to every gang member in the hood with a gun that's you promoting that kind of lifestyle and if you guys have watched gilly over the years whether it's on his podcast or on his instagram page this kind of contradicts the message gilly has been putting out here's one example i was with the game real quick to all the youngins out here that's rock'em sock'em robots yeah you want to be running around here, you know, leading with your gun. You know, your fucking gun bigger than your bankroll. Got a $600 gun and got $142 in his pocket. You run around here under the GBA, the goofball act. I just want to put this on your minds. You only get one time to lose your life. You hear me? You only get one fucking time to lose your life. You want to impress me? Die twice. Die and then come back to life and die again. I bet you that can't happen. So you keep fucking around out here. You only get one time to lose your life. Then you wake the fuck up in heaven. God, is that you? Yes, it is. Come on in. How I get here? Oh, you the bought you slipping. Buttered your croissant. Knocked all the seeds out your fucking watermelon. But I don't know if that's how God going to talk, but he definitely going to break shit down to you when you get there. So you need to act like you fucking know and get it right for you wake the fuck up in heaven. Now, what if the feds see that video and go raid one of them houses over there? Or even worse, what if some of those guys are currently on probation? Somebody now has to go to jail for that. Now, I get it. Nobody's perfect. But at a certain point in life, your message has to be consistent with your actions. Don't switch up depending on who you're with. When you're doing your podcast with Wallow that's peaceful, you're always trying to send a message saying, yo, get out the streets. But once you get around some street dudes and you're in their hood, this is the kind of videos that we get. You guys get in the comments below. How do you guys feel about this Gilly video? Do you guys think this makes him look like a hypocrite? Or do you guys think fans are just overreacting? Post your comments below. Scratch my channel like this video. I'll see you guys later, man.